for a man tackles her to the ground. Now, this happened last night at a well-lit gas station in Wyandotte. And as 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig tells us, the armed robber clearly didn't expect her to fight back. We're only going to call the victim by her first name. It's Tracy, and she says she never imagined anything like this could happen to her in a place she's so comfortable. I parked in front of the gas station because I go there almost every night. I was going to get my usual chocolate milk and a scratch off. And that's when the man who was in the driver's seat of this SUV made his move, tackling Tracy to the ground. And was walking in front of my car, and then I heard him running. And I was just starting to turn because I could hear him running. And that's when he tackled me. This happened just after 9 o'clock last night here at this Sunoco gas station on Fort Avenue near 18th Street in Wyandotte. And the man was trying to get Tracy's wallet. From a camera inside the gas station, you can see part of the attack through the glass doors. Immediately, I just started fighting because when I looked at his eyes, I thought he's going to kill me. And um, I just started fighting. And I know, you know most of us don't want to hurt somebody. But in this case, you have to get ugly. You have to fight back. If you have an object with you, um, whatever you can use to strike the perpetrator, do it. The would-be robber took off when his friend or relative and a store worker ran outside. And Wyandotte police are hoping someone can help recognize him in this blue sweatshirt because he did not stick around like a good citizen would to talk to police. He couldn't even get in the vehicle to get away, so he climbed in through a busted rear window. Well, he definitely knew him. He was in the same vehicle with him. We have to determine is he a suspect or is he a witness? That's what we need to find out. So if you know who he is, call Wyandotte police right away and police say Tracy did the right thing when she fought back. Yeah, if you find yourself in a situation like this, you know, be loud. She's in a public place. Be loud, scream and fight back. You know, a lot of people will tell you, no, just give them what they want. And that's fine if he was sticking a gun in her face, but he attacked her, he physically attacked her. Once somebody physically attacks you, you must fight. In Wyandotte, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.